Today we're at our Cambridge location and we're going to talk about two great recliners. One of them is the Viceroy recliner from Thera Coggin, which I'm sitting on, and the other is the reinvented recliner from American Leather. Both of these recliners are pushback, which means you need to use your body weight to push them back to recline. We're going to talk about the features, the benefits, the pros and the cons, and the differences between the two. So let's go check them out. This is the Viceroy recliner from Thera Coggin. It was designed in 1965 by this guy named Milo Boffman. I don't know if you've heard of him, but he was an iconic designer. And he designed a lot of furniture, and most of it is mid-century, like the Viceroy recliner that I'm sitting in today. This chair was designed to look good at every angle. You can float this chair in any room of your home. The other nice thing about this chair, it's a little bit lower to the ground, so someone that's petite would find it comfortable, but yet since it has a nice high back, someone that's tall will also find it comfortable. The top stitching here also shows the attention to detail that they've given to the chair. So this is a high quality chair made with good materials. It has a hardwood frame. It also has a steel reclining mechanism to it. The wood arms are in solid walnut or you can do them in an espresso finish. It gives you two positions to recline. You can push back easily for the first and you can push back further to relax your whole body to take a nap. And it's very simple to push back and to put the chair back to its regular position. So you can get the Viceroy recliner in fabric for $27.99, but it also goes up in price from there. So if you want to do it in leather, it can be as high as $5,000, but that also depends on what you choose. So it depends if you choose a higher grade leather or you could choose a higher grade fabric. All of that is what contributes to what the price is and where you fall in that range. That's the Viceroy recliner, but now let's see how that compares to the reinvented recliner. Okay, here we are in the reinvented recliner from American Leather. One of the main differences between the reinvented recliner from American Leather and the Viceroy recliner is that there are more styles to the reinvented recliner than the Viceroy. The reinvented recliner come in a variety of styles, such as the Simon, the Quinton, and today I'm sitting in the Burke. Now, the difference in the styles is just slightly different from one another. For instance, the Burke has a roll arm. One of the other chairs might have a track arm. The Burke also has a seat that's a little puffy and a back that's a little puffy, so there's some extra cushion to, to that. Whereas in some of the other styles, you might have a tight seat with a tight back. So when you sit in this, it's really cozy. It does have down in the seats versus the Viceroy, which had a tight seat. This also has these nice wood legs that are removable. They're available in walnut and in gray ash. You can do the chair itself in leather or in fabric. The fabric starts at $22.99 and in leather, let's see, this one is in tangerine, bison tangerine, and it's $29.99. So when you sit in the recliner, it's very similar to the Viceroy in that it has the same three positions that the Viceroy had. You can sit in the chair, you can recline once, or you can recline fully in the chair. And it's very simple to bring it all back to the first seating position. Now that we've talked about both the Viceroy recliner and the reinvented recliner, they both have similar price points, they're both made in America, they both are available in fabric and leather. The one difference to me between the two is that one of them has a mid-century style, whereas the other one gives you more options. So the American leather version of the reinvented recliner, you can get different options for it, such as arm style, seat style, back style, whereas when you look to the Viceroy, that is what you get, is what you see. They're all beautiful recliners and they'll all hold up the test of time. As always, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave us a comment and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.